It's been a week of tragedy for the people of the small Ukrainian village of Kondrashovka, devastated by an airstrike earlier this week. Residents have been burying the victims, 12 people, including a five-year-old boy, killed, dozens more injured in the air raid that some army commanders say was accidental. Artis Maria Finoshina was at the funerals. Just a warning, you may find some of the images in her report disturbing. A day of mourning in the village of Stare Kondrashovka. Residents gathered to pay tribute to those killed in Wednesday's shelling. Ivan, the youngest victim, celebrated his fifth birthday just a day before his death. New toys he didn't even have time to play with. Next to his coffin, another larger one. This is Ivan's father. Vladimir's body and face are covered. Only pieces are left after one of the shells landed a meter away from the man. We visited the village shortly after the bombardment. This is Vladimir's body on the ground. Locals say bombs were dropped from two airplanes. They counted at least 18 craters. Meanwhile, Kyiv denies its air forces were involved. Here's the Ukrainian state media's alternative picture of what happened. За інформацією свідків, в селищі обстріляли з мінометів четверо невідомих, які напередодні пішки перетнули кордон. Без ног, без черепа. Свідки кажуть, головною ціллю терористів була протиповітряна військова частина. Так говорять, що це самі себе обстріляли. Це ж не самоліт літав, ні. Дітьо вибіжало самоліт, посмотри. Терористи тут, хто? П'ятилітній ребенок, терорист. This is not the first child killed in what Kiev calls its anti-terror operation. More than 40 miners have reportedly died since it was launched less than three months ago. And fury over their deaths has now reached Ukraine's parliament. І ми, і ми не дозволимо ганьбити і поплюжити нашу армію. Ніхто із них не приїхав, ніхто не сказав, звініть, будь ласка, за ваших дітей, хотіли жити, як і його внук, як і його дітей. When Olga's boy and husband were buried, another funeral started. And then two more. In recent days, at least six freshly dug graves have appeared at this cemetery. But with a large-scale military operation in eastern Ukraine now underway, locals fear there will be even more. Marifnoshna, Arti, Stare Kondrashovka, Lugansk region, eastern Ukraine.